Welcome friends. In one of the previous session, we had discussed about the stem and leaf display. That was a technique of exploratory data analysis. Now in this session, let us discuss two more techniques of exploratory data analysis. One is known as five number summary. In five number summary, a list of five values is prepared from the list of the data values. For that purpose also, it is advisable or rather it is necessary to arrange all the data values in the ascending order. That means from the lowest to the highest. First is the lowest value or lowest data value. In the list, the second item is lowest quartile or the first quartile that is known as Q1. The third number in the list, third item in the list is median. We know it as Q2 or second quartile. The fourth item is highest quartile or the third quartile. We know it as Q3 and the last one is highest data value. Out of these five, lowest data value and the highest data value are readily available from the ascend data in the ascending order. But these three, lowest quartile Q1, median Q2 and highest quartile Q3, we have to determine according to the method we have already discussed in the previous session. A list of all these five is five number summary. Together with five number summary, there is another technique that is actually a chart or graph known as box plot. We can see a shape of box in this diagram. That's why it is known as box plot. To prepare the box plot chart, first of all, we have to calculate lower limit and upper limit. In this case, the lower limit is first quartile minus 1.5 IQR and the upper limit is third quartile plus 1.5 IQR. So first of all, before proceeding to draw the box plot, we have to calculate IQR and lower limit and upper limit. To calculate IQR, we can have Q1 and Q3 out of the five number summary. So with the help of these two, we can easily calculate lower limit and upper limit. After calculating lower limit and upper limit, we have to refer the data which we have already arranged in the ascending order. And from this data arranged in ascending order, we can easily mark the values or our data values which are outliers. Again, outlier means the data value which is lower than lower limit or the data value which is greater than or more than upper limit. Now we can draw the box plot. The box plot, in the box plot, the box starts from first quartile and ends at third quartile. A shape of box is drawn that starts from first quartile, then it is say a vertical line for median and then it ends at quartile 3 and a shape of closed box is there. Upper limit and lower limit are also marked because we have say written the data values on this horizontal axis. Now the third point is viscous. These dotted lines are known to be viscous. The viscous are from the box or other limit of the box to the smallest value within the lower limit and on right hand side the whisker starts from the end of the box and it goes to the highest or largest value within the upper limit. So whiskers are not from the box to the outliers, no, lowest outlier and highest outlier but they remain within the lower and upper limit. Now we have all the data values in ascending order and we know which values are outlier on the left hand side or outlier on the upper side. We have to mark them on the chart of the box plot. In this way we can present the quantitative data into a form of box plot. But the important thing is before drawing the chart of the box plot, first we should prepare the five number summary. 
then calculation of IQR, then calculation of lower limit and upper limit, and then determination of outliers. After doing all these things, we should go further to do the box load chart. Clear? Thank you.